side. In fact, let's welcome in the management right now. They are joining us, Mr. Atul Lal, MD at Dixon Tech. Sir, thank you so much. Congratulations on a great set of numbers. Thank you for joining us. Despite a challenging environment, you've managed to outperform, outperform quite significantly. What aided the top line growth? Across all our verticals, uh, we have seen a very strong order book in quarter one and we are uh, continuing to have a strong order book in Q2 as well. Uh, so if you see in, in LED television, uh, aided by our orders from the largest uh, smart TV brand in India today, Xiaomi, uh, we have grown by more than 120% in revenues. Uh, similarly, in lighting, uh, today we have more than 45% share of the LED bulb market and the revenues have grown by 71%. In the vertical of washing machine, again we have a pole position in the outsourcing market and uh, it's primarily all this growth is happening uh, due to new customer acquisitions. Margins have only gone or seen a growth of 20 basis points. Uh, what weighing down the margin despite a good volume growth? Uh, you see, uh, one of course is it's the raw material cost. Uh, also, I feel that uh, in some of the verticals we have been able to attain the required operating leverage because of a scale. In some of the verticals we still have some way to go. Uh, uh, so I feel that uh, this is in process and I feel that we'll have a reasonable margin expansions in the coming quarter because the operating leverage will come in uh, because of the scale that we are acquiring across our verticals. Currently what's the portion of your revenues coming in from export? How do you plan to scale it up? So at present uh, the, the uh, export revenue is very minuscule. Uh, to start with, the main focus in export is going to be in lighting as a vertical. Uh, however, I think two, three years down the line, Indian manufacturing across consumer durables, uh, namely in lighting and in washing machines, is going to be globally competitive. And I feel that uh, we are going to be focusing and generating revenues uh, from international markets, even in washing machines, because our plant in Tirupati is going to be close to Chennai port, and we have logistics advantage. Uh, a significant portion of our revenues, both in washing machines and lighting, in next two to three years would come from the global markets. If you look at the consumption sector, primarily the white goods is witnessing a slowdown in volumes. How are you gauging that with your clients? Do you see that impacting revenues with the lag effect? So I feel that, uh, yeah, there is a slowdown. I can sense it uh, uh, when I talk to my customers. However, in Dixon's case, uh, as I shared with you in my opening remarks, our strategy and focus has been on new customer acquisition because we are an outsourcing company. And further to increase the, the, the share of business with our existing customers. So I am very confident that across our, our revenue numbers and profitability numbers, we'll have a robust growth of 35 to 40% in this fiscal. Thanks so much, sir. Congratulations on a great set of numbers. The stock is up 15% as we speak. Uh, Dixon